Today, I will teach you how to assemble home energy storage devices by yourself. This is our newly developed vertical 15kWh energy storage package. We provide all accessories for a complete set of energy storage equipment. Let me introduce you first. This is the communication adapter board. This is copper copper end. This is a waterproof air switch. All our control panels use JKBMS. This is the original JKBMS. We offer a full range of accessories except batteries. We use the mainstream JK control board BMS in the market. BMS brand new original genuine. This is a JK 3.2 inch display. These are copper terminal case. This is the caster. Metal die casting manufacturing process. A single load bearing capacity of more than 80 kg. Now, I'm going to show you how to build this vertical battery box. First, we install the battery. Attention is needed here. The placement of lithium batteries is required. The positive and negative electrodes of the battery need to be crossed as shown in the picture. The left positive electrode corresponds to the right negative electrode. Then cross place the lithium battery. Put epoxy board or EVA foam between the batteries to separate them. We take out the battery and check the plus or minus number on the battery. Remember this positive sign. Below is the positive. The above one is the negative sign. A total of 16 batteries. The battery is installed as required. Now we need to check that the battery is installed correctly. Negative, positive, negative, positive, negative, positive. Installed correctly. The battery pack is already installed. The next step is to install the control panel BMS. This is called a middle bevel, and we attach the BMS to this board. Just tighten the screws. If you are buying our set, we will provide you with this BMS, including soft copper cable, all accessories except batteries. You buy a set of our set of equipment. You only need to buy an additional 16 lithium batteries. You can assemble a set of energy storage equipment of your own brand by yourself. Now teach you how to install BMS. You plug the whole assembly in. Just lock the screws. It's okay to fix it like this. Install the top cover now. First lock these accessories on the top cover. These are all separate by our set. These don't need to be purchased extra. This is the communication adapter board. Also included in the kit accessory bag. After installation, it looks like this. 
Now, we attach this component to the top of the case. We have prepared two baffle brackets. You can install this bracket or not. It will be more beautiful after installation. We'll put it on top together. One left and one right. We lock everything in the back. After it is installed, it looks like this. Now we are going to connect these battery packs in series. Install this acquisition board first. Pay attention to the direction. Both acquisition boards have a number PSA, PSB. It is used to collect and monitor battery signals. We lock this platen bracket to it. Its function is to press the battery and prevent the battery from shaking. Now we are going to connect the battery connector together. It needs to be connected in series with this signal cable. It should be noted here that the positive pole of the battery is connected to the positive pole of the acquisition board. Connect the negative electrode to the positive electrode of the acquisition plate. Remember, don't install it wrong. After it is installed, it looks like this. Okay, we are going to do the other side. Connect the positive electrode of the same battery to the positive electrode of the mining plate. The negative electrode is connected to the negative electrode of the mining plate. The negative electrode is connected to the control BMS negative electrode. Here, you need to connect the empty space to the BMS, as shown in the picture. Just tighten these two screws. Next, we install the cable.
straighten the cable. Plug the communication cable into the adapter board. Plug this cable into the corresponding port. Plug this cable into another port. Plug these two cables into the acquisition board. Note the long connection PSB. The short one is connected to PSA. Now there is only one cable screen left. This is a 3.2 inch display screen, which can be buckled directly on the lid. We plug it into the screen. OK, the whole set of equipment is installed. Then comes the moment to witness the miracle. We press and hold the white switch on the screen. OK, the connection is correct, and it works together. Congratulations! You have learned how to assemble this energy storage device. After completion, connect via mobile phone Bluetooth. Adjust the battery balancing parameters. We close the lid. This is a custom color logo. Make your product stand out. Look behind. Still pretty. This is an air switch. Positive and a negative terminal. The appearance of the entire energy storage box is very simple and smooth. Interested friends, please feel free to contact us. In addition to this, we also develop many styles of energy storage battery boxes. This is a stacked battery box. The single layer box can integrate 5000 watt or 10000 watt of electricity. This is a wall mounted battery box. A single box can also integrate 5000 watt and 10000 watt of electricity. This is also a stacked battery box. This box is suitable for EV 28014 batteries. A single box can integrate 15 to 16000 watt of electricity. Stacked wall layers can integrate 60000 watt. If you have a friend you like, please contact for consultation. This is a small vertical battery box that can integrate 5000 watt of electricity. This is a touch screen battery case. And this is a mass production site. If you want to quickly create your own brand to capture the market, you can contact us for cooperation. We can provide all solutions. You only need to be responsible for marketing and sales to rapidly expand your energy storage business. Email wx.gu at hckamikawa.com.